Scrivener offers several different ways of viewing your work. There are four view modes which can be accessed from the toolbar. Single document mode, scrivenings mode, the corkboard and the outliner. These are displayed by and can be changed using this view mode selector in the toolbar. You're probably familiar with single document mode already. When an individual file is selected in the binder, such as a text document or an image, this mode simply displays it in the editor window. The view mode component in the toolbar will display this, a single document. When you select more than one document, or a folder containing multiple documents, this shifts to scrivenings mode, in which multiple documents are displayed as a continuous scroll, divided by a separator. In this case, a faint dashed line appears to show you where one document rolls over into the next. Using this mode, you can view or edit multiple text documents as though they were a single document. The toolbar icon now looks like two pieces of paper representing a stack of documents, and the text label below it now says group mode instead of view mode, indicating that you're viewing a group of documents. The corkboard, represented by the middle icon, allows you to view multiple documents as index cards on a corkboard. This can either be a selection of documents from the binder, or if you choose a folder or a document with subdocuments, index cards for those subdocuments will appear. Each index card shows the title and synopsis for the document, or if no synopsis has been entered for this document, a preview of the document text appears here. Note that if you're viewing a single document, it's still possible to switch to corkboard mode, but the corkboard will appear blank until you select multiple documents or create subdocuments of the file you're viewing. The next icon opens the outliner, which, like the corkboard, is another way of displaying groups of documents. This time, however, they're displayed in rows, with columns of additional information. The document's label and status appear here by default, but other columns can be added depending on which data you want to view in the outliner. When you're viewing a document group, you have the option of viewing it in single document mode, which will just show you the text of the top document, or toggling scrivenings mode, which allows you to view the document and all its subdocuments as a continuous scroll. The same thing applies if you have a folder which contains text at the folder level, as well as the subdocuments it contains. In this case, you can toggle between these two view modes by selecting or deselecting the document stack icon. We'll cover the different view modes in more depth in other videos, so look out for those if you want more information. Thanks for watching, and happy writing!